Fasten your seatbelts because this might shock you, aviation incidents have skyrocketed by 41% in just three years. That's right, from 2020 to 2023, the skis became a lot less friendly. But don't cancel your flight plans just yet. We're about to take off on a journey through the turbulent world of aviation safety and discover how we can make our flights safer than ever before. Let's start with the elephant in the cockpit, pilot training. Would you believe that some commercial pilots are flying with just 250 hours of experience? That's like letting a teenager drive a bus after they've only had their license for a week. No wonder 47% of crashes in 2023 involved crews with less than 1,000 hours of flight time. But it's not just about hours in the air. Even experienced pilots are training on simulators that are about as cutting edge as a flip phone. These outdated systems don't prepare pilots for modern emergencies, like sudden hydraulic failures that can turn a plane into a very expensive glider. Now let's talk tech. Remember the Boeing 737 MAX fiasco? Well, it turns out that 38% of recent incidents were linked to its problematic MCAS system. And it's not just Boeing. Airbus A320neos have been playing a dangerous game of he said, she said, with their angle of attack sensors leading to 20% of crashes. But wait, there's more. Near misses at airports are becoming as common as delayed flights. In 2023 alone, North America saw 47 close calls, including a hair-raising runway incursion at JFK due to radar issues. It's like playing real-life Frogger but with jumbo jets. So what's the fix? Well, it's not just one thing. We need a five-point plan that's more comprehensive than an airline's terms and conditions. First, let's bump up those pilot hours to at least 1,000 and give them annual refresher courses in crew resource management. Next, let's upgrade our tech with AI-powered maintenance alerts and backup sensors galore. We also need to get regulators on the same page globally. No more of this rules or just suggestions attitude that's prevalent in some parts of the world. And speaking of rules, let's modernize our air traffic control with AI that can predict conflicts before they happen. Gee, it's time for the aviation industry to walk the talk when it comes to safety. Remember, as Psalm 91, 11 says, he will command his angels to guard you in all your ways. But let's give those angels a hand, shall we? With better training, smarter tech, and a commitment to transparency, we can make sure that the only thing falling from the sky is your jaw at how incredibly safe flying has become. So the next time you buckle up, you can rest easy knowing that the industry is working hard to keep you safe from takeoff to touchdown. You can rest easy knowing that the industry is working hard to keep you safe from takeoff to touchdown. With President Trump as President and Vice President Vance, we can be assured that rules will change. Lady Janice loves our pilots and they deserve the best. A shout out to all of them and to our amazing God.